Let's remember how to determine if a relationship is proportional. If you're looking at a table, you would have to test all the ratios of numbers in the table and see if they are equivalent. If they are equivalent, the relationship is proportional. But now, if you're looking at a graph, we have to see if the graph of the numbers forms a straight line and then passes through the origin. That is what determines if a relationship is proportional. Let's take a look at some examples of those now. So here we have our information, our situation. We have a relationship that on a field trip, every chaperone is assigned 12 students. And we want to ask, or we want to find out, is the student to chaperone ratio proportional? So we have our values, our numbers in a table. When there was one chaperone, there's 12 students, two chaperones, 24 students, three chaperones, 36 students, and so on and so forth. But if we were to graph those data points, those numbers on a grid, on a coordinate plane, think of the chaperones as the x values and the students as the y values, making our x and y pairs, right? We have our x as the chaperones on the x-axis, our students on the y-axis, the amount of students on the y-axis. So we can see each data point plotted here, 112, 224, 336, 448, and 560. So now you can see that if we connected the points, they form a straight line. That's the first thing we have to test out in order to see if it's proportional. We then see if we were to extend the line that the line crosses through the origin. That's the second thing we need to test. So since the graph is a straight line through the origin, the relationship is proportional. Let's look at a different example. Here we have our x values and y values, and we want to draw a graph to represent the relationship, and then see is the relationship proportional. So we have our x-axis and our y-axis, so we would plot the points 1, 1 point, or 1, 5.5, not 1.5, 1, 5.5, 2, 7, 3, 8.5, and 4, 10. So here are our four data points, our four points from the table that we want to graph. So now remember, in order to see is the relationship proportional, in, in order to answer that question, two things. One, do the points line up to form a line? Do they line up and you can imagine drawing a straight line right through them? If you had a ruler, you could connect them all together. And then two, does that straight line pass through the origin? So you should be able to answer that yes, you can form a line through the points, but however, the, re the line does not pass through the origin. Here's that origin down here. It would have to pass through the point zero, zero, and you can see your line is too high. It's not going to pass through zero, zero. It looks like it's passing through zero, four. So no, the relationship is not proportional because it does not go through the origin. So again, you have to test it's linear, it's forming a line, the, all the points are going through a line, but it also has to pass through the origin.